DJ Muggs is one of the greatest and most influential hip hop producers of all time. Born in Queens, New York, but being raised in Los Angeles, California, he was the soundtrack to one of the greatest hip hop groups of all time, Cypress Hill. The centerpiece of DJ Muggs' production setup was the SP1200. You can see him in this video using it. The SP1200 is still one of the greatest drum machines of all time for a reason. And as you can see in this ongoing series, how many influential hip hop producers have used this drum machine? The prices are still extremely high for this machine right now. He also used the MPC 3000. You can see him using a drum machine in this video. DJ Muggs have had his fair share of Akai drum machines. He also owned the 2500, the MPC 5000, and of course, the Akai S950. You can see the MPC 2500 in the studio right here. The MPC 2500 is one of the best MPCs on the market right now due to its JJOS compatibility. You can see DJ Muggs using the MPC 5000 here. The Akai S950 can be seen here. A rule of thumb for the S950 is that wherever there is an SP1200 or MPC 3000, you can almost expect to see the Akai S950 or S900 close by. To round off the Akai products, he used an Akai MPD-226 and the Akai MPK-261. In this Instagram picture, you can see him with the MPD-226 and in this picture, you can see him using the MPK-261. As far as the keyboards he used, he used the Moog Mini Moog Model D. You can see it in his recording studio. Last, but certainly not least, is the Roland TR-808 drum machine. You can see him using it in this video. DJ Muggs have produced some of the most critically acclaimed hip-hop albums and songs of all time and is one of the greatest hip-hop producers of all time. He's gone on to produce for some of the greatest artists of all time like Dr. Dre, Cypress Hill, Ice Cube, and Jizza. Shoutouts to Eddie Def for the recommendation to cover DJ Muggs. If you have a producer that I haven't done yet, put it in the comment section below. If you are interested in any of the equipment I spoke about in this video, I have included a link to it in the description below. Thanks for watching.